What's up guys, my name is Technobo here for Troubleshoot and today I've got an incredibly useful fix for you if you're struggling with this in games or anywhere else for that matter. Basically, the issue that I've been having is I've been pressing Ctrl and Shift or Alt and Shift and this menu pops up on the side of my screen. When this happens, my keyboard is completely disabled and if you're inside of a full screen game, the next time you click, it won't register as long as you're holding down either Alt or as long as you're holding down shift after this message pops up. And of course, the same with control shift can happen. This is happening because there are multiple keyboards with alt and shift or multiple languages on your computer with control and shift. Now, as far as I know, for most people who have this issue or have this enabled on their computers for whatever reason, if you're like me and you only have one language and only one keyboard on your computer, how on earth is this happening? Well, if you've added multiple languages in the past, or changed languages, this is probably something that you're struggling with. And in order to turn off this Alt Shift or Control Shift integration is rather difficult, especially on Windows 10. If you were to go ahead and Google it, you'll find tons of results for Windows 7 or Windows 8. However, Windows 10 is left out of the loop somehow. If you have a look inside of the control panel options, you'll find it basically nowhere. And following guides step by step, you'll always find out that one or two buttons are missing where you need them to be. So if you can't find it in the settings or control panel window, how exactly do you disable or change this feature? Well, as soon as you know the way around it, it's rather simple. All you need to do is check the description down below for a piece of text. Go ahead and copy it, hold start and press R so this run dialog box pops up and we'll be pasting it in here. So what exactly is this? Well, opening up a notepad file, this is what it is. So run DLL32, brings up the control panel and into this specific window over here, followed by the hotkeys section. So if I hold start, press R, paste it in and hit enter, this window over here pops up. Text services and input languages. And if you haven't seen this window before, well, then welcome to the club. I'm basically unable to get here through any other means other than that piece of command line text. Either way, once we're inside of here, simply click on between input languages and click change key sequence. When you're in here, hit not assigned, not assigned, OK, and apply. Then if you have multiple ones of these, make sure you click on each one, change key sequence, and make sure it's disabled, OK, apply. Then when you hit Alt and Control, nothing happens. When you hit Control and Shift, nothing happens. And of course, if for some reason you do use that menu, you can click change key sequence and you can set this to literally whatever you want. So sometimes a grave accent, go ahead and press it and the screen will pop up. But I'll leave it to not assigned, not assigned, apply, okay, and now it's gone. It's not something that you need to worry about anymore. But either ways, that's about it. That is how to disable the language selection menu that pops up sometimes when you're playing games or things like that. Hopefully this video helped you. And I'll see you all next time. Ciao.